Hi everyone and welcome. I am Malika Pathak and today we will be discussing about project scenarios and will also be looking at some different scenarios that any project coordinator or manager will or might face while working on a project. Today we will be discussing what are project scenarios, some benefits of project scenario analysis, how scenario analysis helps in project management, different scenarios in project management. So let's jump in. What are project scenarios? A project schedule is a prediction of future outcomes or states. For example, by May 18th, we will be 24% complete. It's a forecast of delivery date, project completion date, engineering completed, start of application, start of construction, delivery of equipment and materials, planned and future performance, resource utilization, resource availability and more. It also includes numerous assumptions that are often made relatively early in the project life cycle. In fact, perhaps the single most important assumption in assuming the project will go ahead as planned. But does it? Using scenario analysis on some or all of the project schedule enables project managers to change their assumptions and make more informed decisions. Benefits of using project scenarios Number 1. Evaluation of possible outcomes a project manager can use scenario analysis to see how a given outcome such as project cost might be affected by changes in particular variables such as the late delivery of supplies or the unavailability of key personnel. This provides them with greater insight into the possible uncertainties they are likely to encounter and the impact of these risks on the successful completion of the project. Second, more informed decisions or actions. What if scenario planning allows a project manager to respond to alternative situations more quickly and effectively? Because they have developed strategies to minimize the impact of the change. With the insight that what if analysis provides, project managers can make more informed decisions about the future of the project, reducing uncertainty. Third is improved project predictability. A what if scenario is an informal speculation about how a given situation might be handled. The more questions that are asked, answered and reviewed throughout each stage of the project life cycle, the more informed the project manager and the more predictable the project outcome is. Number 4. Analysis of simple and complex factors What if analysis is an umbrella term for a type of evaluation that measures the effect on a project outcome should one of the primary elements be changed. At its most complex, Monte Carlo analysis can be utilized to provide analysis throughout unlimited scenarios. To answer basic questions, a simpler method of what-if analysis can be used to extract the necessary information more rapidly. Improved Project Management What-if analysis allows project managers to recognize options and impact from events and changing assumptions. With proper utilization, Project managers can not only make more informed decisions by changing assumptions and observing or estimating the results, but it is also possible to better predict the outcome of those decisions. Project management will always be categorized by degree of uncertainty, changes, impact from events and deviation from plan. The challenge in managing these events and this uncertainty to understand the latest impact so that schedule changes can be made from the latest data available so that contingencies or alternative schedules can be communicated. Now let's discuss a few scenarios that any project coordinator or project manager might or might have faced. Number 1. What if the client doesn't revert after the statement of work is signed? Reaching out to the client through emails, calling them personally, reaching out on LinkedIn or other associated platforms and asking the sales team associated with that particular client for an update. Second, what if the client is not able to provide accurate requirements even after multiple project kickoff calls? The project manager should be capable of pointing out the exact requirements and choose the suitable resources according to the requirements because not all resources have all the competencies. Number 3. How to handle a situation when the project team gives unattainable deadlines. It is the project manager or coordinator's responsibility to make sure that hard questions or cross questions are asked to the project team for justifying the deadline before presenting it to the client. Project manager must act as an end client for the project team which can prevent them from sharing falter or wrong information to the actual end client. Number 4. What if the project deadline is missed? 
in case the project team is about to or has missed a deadline it is imperative that the project manager must inform about the roadblocks being faced by the team either internally or externally and must find a better way to overcome them it is project manager's responsibility to make sure the deadline is not missed remind the team about the deadlines organize or conduct multiple demo sessions internally before presenting it to the client number 5 what if the team has insufficient skills required by the client project manager must understand and identify the skill sets required in a project and organize a team accordingly in case the insufficiency has been identified due to an additional requirement then more resources can be added based on the required skill sets number 6 What if there's a communication gap in the team? Communication is essential in making sure the project runs smoothly and is delivered on time. In case there is a gap in communication, internal meetings can be scheduled to make sure everyone is updated and an internal communication channel is established. Number 7. Sometimes clients don't share all the information required to start the engagement due to credibility issues. There are many many cases where the prospects are worried about the consultant or vendors and their working style and whether it will match with theirs or not. To overcome this project manager can offer signing of the NDA for data protection and safety, starting a pilot project that will help in creating a trust between all the parties, sharing a glimpse of the previous similar projects via case studies or demo videos or blogs, setting up communication channel and meeting schedules to keep the client updated. If allowed the consultant or vendors can share the references of some of their clients for whom they have worked in the past. Number 8 Find a project management tool to manage all also keeping this in mind if the team will be able to use proficiently. Managing a project on a project management tool such as Jira, Asana, Trello or monday.com or similar ones makes the job of the project manager very easy. Such tools can help in getting the required information such as timeline updates, creating reports, hours utilization and so on. Project managers can provide a brief to the team so they can provide updates and communicate on the tool itself with the client. Number 9. What if there is an issue with the availability of the resources or if one of the resources from the team left and there is no shadow resource available? Initially while selecting the resources for the particular project make sure to have a shadow resource or lock a shadow resource who will also have all the knowledge of the project so when some resources leave that shadow resource will be able to take over and complete the task here are a couple of links that can help you in going over some more scenarios and situations related to a project or a project management some of the principles of scenario planning have significant benefit the primary role of appears to be in risk management The concept of scanning for indicators of fundamental changes in the overall environment that signal a variance from the planned future is central to effective of project management. In addition, the predetermined from a scenario planning perspective can facilitate no regrets decision by the project management team. This was all about project scenarios. Thank you for watching this video.